you don't mean that. I do. No, that's not you. It's that woman. The one you just attacked. She's taken my daughter away from me. Now she's trying to take my she grandson. She's done nothing she should try and get her own family and not try and steal mine. Shut up, Mum. I'm sorry. I was only trying to help. Are you OK? I'm fine. Just do what you have to do. <gasps> Carla. I just need some time. I'll go. She is turning you against me. No, you turned me against you. Carla has been nothing but kind and considerate. She's manipulating you. You think I'm that stupid? That I'd be that easily led? The way you're letting that woman run your life? Yes! And now she's crying crocodile tears and trying to get everybody's support. She's not faking it, Mum. Carla can't have children. And now you've just rubbed it in her face. Well, right, I'm sorry, I, I didn't know that, but still, that doesn't give her the right to try and tear my family apart. Well, you're doing a great job oh, at it yourself. Nicole, I love you. Don't do this. I'm not doing anything. I'm just living my life. Without me? Yeah. And it's better off for it. This isn't you. Something's very wrong. No, no, no th this, this is me. You just need to back off. Me, Billy, and Carla. So, media's been confirmed. You still sure about this, Michelle? Putting your face out there after everything? I've got to go. Bien, how can I... Carla Summerfield. Our new hire? Mm-hmm. She's a manipulator, a mind controller. She's crazy. What happened? Ever since she came here, she has ripped my life apart. She is dangerous. How so? She's turned Nicole against me. Nicole's in therapy with Carla, is that correct? Well, therapy, brainwashing, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Carla is a trained psychotherapist. She babysat my grandson. Belle. Yes. OK, that's a problem. I was available, Zara. And Nicole chose her therapist over me to look after her child. Doesn't that seem a little bit odd to you? I'm not sure what you want from me, Leanne. Get rid of her. Well, I can't just fire her because you don't like her. What's she been saying about me? What? Nothing. Well, she's been in here, hasn't she? Spinning her lies. No. Well, I am a stalwart of this hospital. I've been here long before your time. What are you saying? Either she goes or I go. <laughs> You're not serious. Deadly. I won't work with her in this hospital. Carla is an employee and you are a volunteer. Yeah, so? So? I'm sorry, Leanne, but if you are asking me to choose between you and her... It's her. I'm sorry you feel this way, Leanne, but you can hand over your fossil vest when you're ready. You're both so sweet. I'll be fine. You're a trooper. Well, Leanne's been going through a lot. I do understand. <sighs> and more forgiving than I'd be. Um, no, here if you want to talk. I'm so sorry that that happened. I'm so sorry that I didn't recognize the full extent of what you've been dealing with. Now that I've experienced it firsthand, I see just how necessary keeping your distance has been. Are you sure you're okay? I'll be fine. Clients await. I could do with a wine tonight. Mm -hmm. My place? Good love to. You can't let this happen. What happened? First you, and then Belly, and now my job. What are you talking about? If not as my daughter, then as D-O-N. You know what knowledge and experience I bring to this hospital. What are you talking about? I've been fired. You can't be fired. You don't work here. I told Zara to choose between me and Carla, and she chose Carla. Well, of course, the employee over the volunteer. Well, I was just trying to... And stirring about Carla. Oh, oh Nicole, please, I... I... I can't lose this too. See, Mum, this is why we can't be in the same orbit. It just ends up with drama and unhappiness. No. So perhaps more space is what we each need. More space? You're not thinking straight, Mum. So you, you just focus on the IV and leave Carla and I to our work here. 